How Zachary Zaxor Destroyed the Mental Health of Alex Einstein Hello guys, welcome back to another video here on Game Circuit. We all know that Zach left the Inquisitor Master Squad and this might be for good, but in the process, he may have taken a vow to destroy Inquisitor Master and her squad and ruin her mental well-being, it seems. Dreg 2 couldn't wait to rub salt into Alex's wound as he followed Zack out. So, why would the twins want to go out and start a new squad when Inquisitor Master was just on the doorstep of a milestone? There's more to the story and in this video we will reveal everything, so stay tuned and watch. Isn't it surprising that Zack and Drake decided to leave the squad just when things were starting to look great for Inquisitor Master? Both twins had returned and the squad was going to be complete after nearly a year. But Zack and Drake decided to make a U-turn and completely cut ties with Alex and the squad. Certainly, they had something cooking way before they decided to shock us and the entire squad. Zack wanted revenge for the breakup. Zack was heartbroken when he saw Levi and Alex get so close on his return back on the squad. Zack was not happy one bit, but he decided to keep quiet and not let the emotions get the better of him. He knew that Alex and the Inquisitor Master channel depend on him since he was the most popular squad members with fans and the other squad members. Zack took his time and just when fans were expecting Drake to return, he dropped the bomb and created the Z Squad, initially known as the Pack. Drake and his revenge. Just like Zack, Drake also wasn't happy with Inquisitor Master Alex for expelling him and permanently banning him from the squad. We all thought it was Drake's who left the squad, but we never realized that the reasons Drake left was due to Alex who constantly pestered him on everything he did. Alex may have shown no interest on Drake's return, but he secretly wanted him back on the squad since he knew that Drake was the one who could fix the squad. But Drake, like his twin, decided to join the Z squad and thus starting a competition between the two squads, raiding the Inquisitor Master squad for gems. The Inquisitor Master Squad is no doubt the best Roblox roleplay squad filled with talented members and even with the twins gone, the Inquisitor Master Squad was quite strong. But when Zack created the new Z Squad, the first thing he decided was to raid the Inquisitor Master Squad and take away the gems, Jade and Charlie. These two were among the oldest squad members and thus had the talent and Zack took the opportunity and lured them with offers they couldn't refuse. That's right. Jade and Charlie are having an amazing time on the squad. Right now, Jade is playing multiple characters at once while Charlie is no longer bullied and she's even showcasing her talent by playing Darkness. Definitely, these two will spend a long time in the Z squad. Jade and Drake's marriage. If you're wondering how this has any connection to Alex, then hear us out as we explain. Jade and Drake have always longed for each other's company. Though they never showed their love openly on camera, they always have been close to each other and it seems Alex was not too keen. She also wanted to get married to Zack before any of her friends did, but the recent breakup with Zack spoiled all her plans. However, it is believed that Alex was both shocked and angry on hearing that Drake and Jade were getting married. And you know who is the mastermind behind all of this? Zack, after all. It was Zack who planned and announced that his brother and Jade were finally taking the decisions to marry. The 9 million subs challenge. Zack and the senior squad members left the squad just before Inquisitor Master Channel was about to cross the 9 million subscribers mark. They didn't even wait for Alex and the squad to cross a new milestone. Alex may have received the message that Zack was angry and he wouldn't wait a second. However, she couldn't believe that Jade and Charlie would love her abruptly. This shook her, Zack lured all the fans and viewers. Zachary Zaxor is doing great as the new channel is introducing new characters and playing different Roblox games. They don't stick to one game unlike Inquisitor Master and seems to be enjoying themselves. Everyone is free to be themselves and act how they wish. Charlie and Jade are growing further as actors. Meanwhile, Inquisitor Master isn't doing bad but the mood has certainly dampened as the loudest members have left and even though Inquisitor Master is trying for new members, it seems unlikely anyone will join. With that, we wrapped up today's video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.